Hello, hello. Welcome to another day of Vlogmas. It's 7.30 a.m. and I just got back to Jeannie's house. Originally, the plan was to come back last night, but then it got so late that my mom said I should stay over there. Jeannie started to shake so much that I was worried that she was uncomfortable and wanted to come home, so I just took her home and I realized I thought I was dog sitting through tomorrow, but I'm actually dog sitting through today and I have no idea what time today. So they could be coming back in the morning, in the afternoon, in the night, I don't know. I am going to start packing my things and cleaning things up, trying to make things look presentable just in case they come back at any moment. And then I'm either gonna hang out here and work on the video that was supposed to go up last night but didn't because I left my laptop here, or I'm gonna go back home and sleep for a bit or work in my room for a bit, I don't really know. I sent a text message to them asking through what time I'm supposed to be here. It's a bit difficult not knowing exactly when this is over. I'm just trying to prepare for whenever it is. Okay guys, I'm trying not to freak out, but we have a bit of a situation here. I left the umbrella open the other night and um, it, it got whisked away, I guess. Well, where is it? Did it fall on the people going into the barber shop below? Did it go flying into the neighbor's house? It's on the roof. Literally, how? And how am I gonna get it down? I mean, it's not that far, but it's far enough. I don't really wanna stand on this ledge here. Yeah, I don't really wanna stand on this ledge. And even if I did, I would still be too short. So I'm not sure how I'm gonna grab that. Oh God, how am I gonna figure this one out? How? I mean, I'm glad it didn't totally blow away, but geez. Okay, I don't know what I'm gonna do because I can just barely hit it with this broom, but it's so heavy and maybe possibly stuck on the roof somehow, like stuck on something, that it's not really moving. I need to get higher up to get better leverage, but this chair is not stable. I'm not going on this ledge. And I don't know if they have a ladder. I doubt they would have a ladder because what would they need a ladder for in here? Uh, how, how? How did this happen to me? And why? My life is literally a movie. I have no idea how I'm gonna fix this. There's no way to get up there. There's no fire escape or anything to climb to the, the roof that I can see. Okay, I have found this paddle thing and I got a more sturdy chair, but I'm still way too low and I just don't have the right force to move it and this is so embarrassing because if anyone in these windows looks out or if anyone across the way looks out they're gonna see me failing and i don't know what time these people are coming back and i want to um, give them their umbrella back because it's sitting right there i don't understand how it flew up out of here and didn't knock out any of this stuff this pot any of these like dishes all of this was fine i kind of made a mess because i rearranged everything to put this chair in here but like not a single thing is broken. Maybe those wires used to be over the top. I don't know. Huh? If I just had a ladder or something, I'm only this far. And yeah, I didn't do my nails yet. Don't judge. I am this far from grabbing it. Oh my God. I just want to like pull it down, but it's going to be big and heavy. Oh my God. Okay. So I've been trying to use this thing to move it closer. And all I've done is this. And it's like, if I could just go on this ledge, Maybe I could just barely not be able to reach it to try and pull it down. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I asked my brother if he could bring me a ladder because a ladder won't fit in my car and I can't find one here. I don't think they own a ladder because they're in an apartment. Why would they need one? I don't know. I just need somebody to help me. I'm so close to fixing this problem, but I can't do it on my own. All right, my brother totally saved me and brought a ladder from home. And then he put the ladder over here in this corner and balanced with one foot on the ladder, one foot on that ledge, and reached up and got this thing. Success. All right, Jeannie. Your family's about home, so I'm gonna head out. I'm sorry to leave you alone for a little bit. She seems really like lonely and clingy and sad right now. She's sniffing my squishmallow. Don't worry, Jeannie, they're gonna be back soon, okay? Jeannie, it's okay. I have a feeling she's gonna try to follow me. Oh, yeah, no, Jeannie, you stay here. 
You stay here, and your family will be with you shortly, okay? They'll be here soon, don't worry. I left you some food if you want to eat, finally. You can do that. And I'll see you next time, okay? Ricotta now. Look at that ricotta. Fine. <laughs> Fine grains of ricotta. It's Searching. like it won't produce Searching. much. Maybe that's it. Searching for gold. Beautiful. I think we made ricotta. Uh, no. no, really. It's a lot of ricotta. We should make lasagna then. No, but really, seriously, maybe that's what it is. It's sweet because it's been recooked. But it was sweet to start with the first time we cooked it. Just came into my room after brushing my teeth and sweet little George Michael is all curled up and ready for bed. Oh my gosh, I've never seen him do this before. George Michael, you're so sweet.